In chapter 3 of the letter to the Philippians in the New Testament of the Holy Bible, the writer, who was Paul, draws a distinction between two groups of people. First, those people who are not Christians, and then people who are born-again Christians. Let's have a quick look in chapter 3 of the letter to the Philippians, verses 17 to 19, dealing with non-Christians, and then verse 20, which deals with Christians. Verses 17 to 19 talk of non-Christians whose end is destruction, whose God is their belly, and whose glory is in their shame. People who set their mind on earthly things. But then in verse 20, Paul talks about Christians. For our citizenship is in heaven, from which we also eagerly await for the Saviour, the Lord Jesus Christ. So Christians have their citizenship in heaven. When I look at my passport, it tells me a number of things. It tells me that I'm a citizen of the European Union. It tells me that I'm a citizen of the United Kingdom of Great Britain and Northern Ireland. My passport entitles me to access into the United Kingdom. Being a citizen has certain rights and responsibilities. One of the rights is that when I come from abroad back to the UK, either to a seaport or to an airport, I show my British passport and one of the entitlements of this is that I am then allowed entry into my country. I have dual citizenship if you like. In fact more than that I have citizenship in heaven as well. So that when I'm no longer on this earth, when I pass away, I am being a citizen of heaven, I have an entitlement. I have a right of entry to heaven. That's one of the major blessings of being a born-again Christian in a relationship with Almighty God through faith in what the Lord Jesus Christ has done. So if the question ever arises in a conversation between you and other people, who gets to go to heaven? The answer I suggest is quite simple. If a person is a born-again Christian, then he or she has his or her citizenship in heaven and he or she has a right, an entitlement to enter into heaven. So I know because my citizenship is in heaven, as well as being a citizen of the EU, the European Union and of Great Britain, I know that my future is going to be in heaven because I have, because of what the Lord God Almighty has done, I know I have free access into heaven.